you didn't have a uh, uh, heat electric heat or gas heat. Heat stove. No, yeah, right. the heat stove. You cut the cut wood, the wood up there. put it in there. Because I used to go right across the street from the Tyson, this guy named Candy Boy. Candy Boy was a real tough guy. I think I had, and uh, I used to be a real tough guy. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, he would, uh, I would cut wood in his house for him, help him cut wood and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it was a big thing for me to do it. But Tyson had a white horse. Everybody knew about that, a white horse. Chickens outside. Jackson had, I think they had chickens and stuff outside their uh, uh, yard, backyard, stuff like that, years back. Mm -hmm. yeah, but I'm talking about the late late 40s and the early 50s like that. Mm -hmm. I was like about eight years old, I was running around up there. Mm -hmm. I knew all about that. Yeah, yeah okay. That's, and, um, that's a lot of history. Marshall Heights was, Marshall Heights was, Marshall Heights was special, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, it still is. It still is. Yeah, well, it's not, not like it used to be in your time. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you don't see no more. It's commercial now. Yeah, the pump. You see the, you see the kids we'll cut the buckets to the pump up there, the pump will pump the water. Pump the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, think come up and a little snug on the mm -hmm. and it puts the two in, and that's how you get your water. Right, so right. You gather the cut wood. I mean, this was natural. I mean, wow. I mean, it wasn't nothing like, hey, look at this guy doing. I mean, that was that was natural, uh -huh. and that was one of the reasons why I got a reputation because you know, I understand I'm on my own because I had to fight a lot of guys. They thought I was better than they were because I. My, my father lived in a house about a block and a half away from Marshall Heights. Mm -hmm. And it had heat in it, it had electric in it, it had running water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. So right. I, I grew up with that too, I man. Halfway, yeah. halfway. Mr. Mr. You know, Davis, I, I grew up with the same thing. We used to do this. This is the truth, man. Mark, uh, I mean, well, I don't mind me saying this, but Marsh knows this. I remember I saw him like this. Marsh used to go to, and I did too, I did too, and I saw him too. He used to take cardboard boxes. Cut it off and put it underneath your shoe because your shoe had a hole in it. Oh, wow. Yeah, mm -hmm. like that. You still wear them down wear the big brother shoes because they yeah. didn't have enough shoes to go around. Yeah, yeah. Hand yeah. me down. Were big like that. Mm -hmm. you know, the Drews, the Russells, the Tysons, the Jacksons. Mm -hmm. It was like that. Well, t who was the um, the first gangster that you was getting ready to tell us about? Well, the, the real good bar star, I mean, Lester told me about this. Mm -hmm. But my father told me about it too. Who was your father? My father was born. He's, he, he used to work on cars. He was an automobile mechanic. You know, okay. He worked on cars. Okay. He knew Lester, too. Okay. And sometimes Lester would bring his car. My father would fix his car. Right. My father was born. He grew up and born and raised on that place called Iron City. Iron City. Yeah, I know that. Yep. Yeah, I see that. I see that's where I was born. Okay. My mother couldn't even make it out of the house. That uh, lady called a midwife. She bad. Right, right. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, and that's how I was born. Okay. But uh, the Lester told me about it, and my father told me too, but mm -hmm. mainly my father, the Lester verified it more. Uh, there was a guy named White Top Simpson. White Top Simpson. You heard of him? No, no but I never heard of him. Yeah. I wasn't even born yet. Yeah. Yeah. He, <laughs> he, he was a number back. Oh, yeah, number back. Okay, what, what era was this? What year? Uh, what generation? Just the 30s to about the oh, 50s. Man. Okay. Yeah. White yeah. Top I Simpson. I heard. I heard that he went down Lord and they and they bombed a special bomb come in telling you he had special privilege in Lord. <laughs> you heard of the Lord Yeah, I heard of him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been there.